Welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. What we have here, which is 9 raised to the power x equals to 60. Here, we take the log on both sides. That is, we have log 9 raised to the power x equals to log 60 on this side. The next step here, we apply the power of logarithm. When we have log m, Raised to power p. This is the same thing as p log m. That is, here yeah, this becomes x log 9 equals to log 60 on this side. That is, next step, we divide both sides by log 9. Divide this side by log 9. Also, divide this side by log 9, which implies here yeah, log 9 cancelled each other. We are left with x. Which is equals to log 60 over log 9. Then, from what we have here, we can express 60 here as 3 times 20, which implies x now becomes log 3 times 20. Then over log 9. That is, yeah, this follows the law of logarithm. When we have log a times b, it's same thing as log a plus log b. Then what we have now becomes x equals to log 3 plus log 20 over log. 9 and also here we separate this into two fractions and we have x equals to log 3 over log 9 plus log 20 over log 9 then also from here we can as well express 20 as 4 times 5 which implies here yeah, this becomes x equals to log 3 over log 9 plus log 4 times 5 over log 9. Then this also follows from the law of logarithm that is, we have x equals to log. 3 over log 9 a plus log 4 plus log 5 then over log 9 and also here we separate this into two fractions and we have x now equals to log 3 over log 9 plus log 4 over log 9 plus log 5 over log 9. And from what we have here, and express 4 as 2 times 2, which is 2 squared, and also 9 as 3 times 3, which is 3 squared. That is, what we have becomes x equals to log. 3 over log 3 square then plus also here we have log 2 square over log 3 square then plus here we have log 5 over log 3 square then from here we apply the power of logarithm 2 comes here also here from here and not here as well we have x now equals to log 3 over 2 log 3 then plus here we have 2 log 2 over 2 log 3 then plus here we have log 5 over 2 log 3 
That is, yeah, log 3 cancelled each other. We have 1 over 2 left, which implies x equals to 1 over 2 plus here 2 cancel each other. We have log 2 over log 3 left and plus here. This can be written as half times log 5 over log 3. That is, and what we have here now. We can apply change of base when we have log a over log b. This is the same thing as log a to base b. Then, yeah, what we have becomes x equals to half plus log 2 is 3, then plus half log 5 base 3. Then, also from here. We can bring this together as one fraction and write it as x equals to the SCM here is 2 and here this be 1 plus here becomes 2 log 2 base 3 then plus here we have log 5 base 3. So here we have the value of x in this problem as 1 plus 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 is 3 all over 2. Then let's check here if this satisfies this given problem. That is, we substitute the value of x here, which is x equals to 1 plus 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2. Then, what we have here becomes 9 raised to power 1 plus 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 then all over 2. Is it equals to 60 on this side? Then, from here we can express 9 as 3 square, which is raised to power 1 plus 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2. Is it equals to 60 on this side? And here this power multiplies and 2 here cancel each other. And we are left with 3 raised to power 1 plus 2 log 2 is 3 plus log 5 is 3 then is equals to 60 from here and this here follows on law this is when we have a raised to power n plus n the same thing as a raised to power n times a raised to power n that is this can be written as 3 raised to power 1 times 3 raised to power 2 log 2 base 3 times 3 raised to power log 5 base 3 this is equals to 60 on this side. And here, 3 raised to the power 1, that's 3 times. We can revise this 2 from power log, and we have 3 raised to the power log 2 square now, then base 3 times. Also, 3 raised to the power log 5 base 3. Is it equals to 60 on this side? Then here, this is 3 times 3 raised to the power log 2 square, that's 4. Is 3 times also 3 raised to the power log 5 is 3. Is this equals to 60 on this side? And from here, this follows when we have a raised to the power log b to base a, which is equals to b. At this here, we have 3 times 4 and times 5 is equals to 60 on this side. That is. 4 times 5 here, yeah, that's 20, then times 3, that's 60, which is equal to 60 on this side. That is, here we have the left hand side now equals to the right hand side. And ends from here, we conclude that x equals to 1 plus 2 log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2 satisfy this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps.
subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell on share this video give it a thumbs up and put your comments and also join our membership package see you next class and bye for now